So do you want to develop a sense of family unity within your family? Well, today we talk about how. Welcome to Living Life Strong, where I give you powerful how-to tips on how you can happen to your life instead of your life happening to you. So in today's world, a lot of us struggle with family unity and oneness. We don't see each other as much as previous generations, but that doesn't mean that our families don't need unity. Most families actually crave unity, but the natural drift of all groups is apart. So intentionality is important because family unity does not always come easily. So to develop that sense of unity, you and your family members, they all have to learn to prioritize family. So some things that you can do, especially if you're parents, is avoid putting work before family plans. And then teenagers, whenever they begin working, make sure that family plans are priority. You don't cancel family plans if you can help it. And this can be difficult, especially if you have a demanding job or you own your own business. But if you, see, if you frequently cancel on your family to work late or pick up extra shifts, it can seriously affect your family's sense of unity. So making your family aware that they are your main priority is very important. They may not know how much that they mean to you. So just ensure that they know. Tell them on a regular basis verbally and let them know that one of the things that you value most is your family. And then another great thing to do is to adopt family traditions. They can create a sense of identity for the family as a whole. They also give individuals something to look forward to. Um, you know, and then also they help create gatherings that bring the family together. And so we have different family traditions. We on Christmas Eve we always get family pajamas. We always get pajamas. And then also we have weekly traditions like church or Taco Tuesday. And so maybe you have Thursday game nights, Saturday walks. Think about what family traditions that you have within your family. But the most important thing that you could do is to actually gather together whenever possible. This allows you the time that you need in order to have all those conversations and traditions that will actually unify the family. So put your family first. Make sure they know that they are the priority. Adopt some family traditions. It's a great way to, to create synergy within your family and then gather, gather as quickly and regularly as possible. Have a great family and live life strong. Don't forget to subscribe and follow Living Word on social media. We post content each and every week and you don't want to miss out. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, our Facebook page, and our Instagram, and make sure to turn on notifications for all three, so you'll receive the latest news, updates, and content right at your fingertips.